Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome to another episode of Craft the World. Let me get the pause there and and uh, glance down at my list. What is our plan for today? We've got a another attack coming in 36 minutes or so. So before that happens, I want to get at least four rows deep of stone at each of these points here and on the other side. And be nice to get into a little bit of farming today if, if uh, the tech tree will let me. And speaking of the tech tree, I think that's probably a good place to start. I've alluded to this, we kind of looked through it a little bit, but there's actually quite an extensive tech tree here as far as, as what we're going to be able to research and work our way through by the end of the game. There's a lot here. It just keeps going. Ending in Mithril. So we're going to get into... Let's see, we're starting with... Where is there's the iron should get into steel I believe next does it say that not in the titles but then we'll hit silver then gold I'm sure they're here somewhere I think it mostly shows up in the weapon or in the armor where is that down in here iron boots silver boots there's gold and eventually mithril. Okay, but lots of technology. We'll get into railroads, uh, rolling railroad cars back and forth, uh, different types of housing styles. So from wood housing to I think stone, brick, um, what else? We'll get into ballista to, uh, to shoot uh, you know, off in the distance. We'll have lots of different monsters coming at us too so there's gonna be flying monsters before long gargoyles anyway yeah there's a lot to look forward to we've just scratched the surface and where to go today we've got so 30 some minutes plus the battles this is probably gonna be a long episode I would think so the next time will be a, sh a shorter episode and then the next battle after that oh they're just talking away because what that means is we haven't given them something to do so we got to do that um, this is a, a trap of that exp you know expires so let's take that out and put in the ladder system here can I I cannot I can destroy it I cannot interesting so this door this is new to me this wasn't in the game when I was playing it before oh 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 don't you fall down there okay <laughs> Um, so how do we get up there? Well, I guess we just plan the next, uh, well, temporarily. Well, temporarily, we need more ladders. So let's grab a couple more of those. Right there. And, well, let's, let's do quite a few, something like that. But, um, where am I? Let's give them a temporary way to get down from there when this expires, if we haven't gotten into this area yet. We will soon, though. we got to get into coal and, and all this. But meanwhile... I want four layers deep right here. So let's set up some temporary ladders like so. Let's put torches down below like that. And remove that one, remove that one. Then let's stone, oh, I would say there, there, and then a layer of it here. And they should not try to dig their way through next time. Theoretically. Mm, that one's not needed. Okay. In fact, these two are probably not needed. I think that would be adequate like that. Uh, we're already four deep over here where they're going to stand and pound. If it's four deep, I think it cancels out their, their desire to even attempt it. So I don't think I've ever seen them get up on top of each other and then start pounding sideways. I might be entirely wrong, but I don't think I've... I've never seen it before, so we'll see if I'm right or not. All right, that's coming down. Let's grab another one there. Stone, and that's enough. No, let's do that one. Okay, that gives us a diagonal. And while we're at it, I wonder if they can reach this from the side. Probably not. Let's do, we'll do that, and let's put dirt in there. Replace stone. All right, that's this side. Yeah, I'm tempted to do that anyway. Let's do this. Uh, replace front. And just to kind of clean that up. Give us a nice, even curve through there. Alright, over here. 
What are we going to do? This is only a problem if we expand to there. <laughs> we, we clipped off one little thing of wheat and suddenly 800 experience points. Really? Um, okay. Man, we lost another round of mana. <laughs> and we got three complimentary stone and two leaves just for our efforts. All right. Well, in that case, let's get this in here before something uh, grows there. Who's our new dwarf? We just got Yanni. So, Yanni, you need at least a couple of those and some silver boots. Sure, you can have those. Welcome. And let's get also the axe. Mm, that's interesting. Double click on it, it shows you the recipe again. I guess I haven't done that. So do that, get a couple of those, and some armor there. Just one each to make sure we've, we can do two of those. But I can't do another one of the, oh, I can. All right, we'll go ahead. We're out of rope, okay. So, uh, mid midday, looks like noon, a little past noon. What do we need to be doing off in the distance? Let's go get some chicken parts. Chicken's going, no! And while we're at it, let's go ahead and get the rest of the stuff here. In fact, let's try and take... I could take uh, a whole top off there and kind of even that out. Well, let me do that. Eventually, we get into fishing. In fact, there's some fish I've never seen before, so they've definitely up dated the graphics on the fish. Okay, you... No, don't do that. I want to take that tree out. There we go. Alright, that'll clean all that up. You guys can haul that stuff in. Now, there's a... I think that's the same boar that we couldn't make them take out last time. Let's figure out why. Take those. Definitely use the wood. And In fact, when we start building the house, we're going to use a lot of wood. So... We want to be uh, stockpiling that. And it's nice for them not to have to climb this stuff and move around. So I'm kind of clipping off the tops of a lot of this stuff. I see. When they change their level, they lose the command to attack. And they've got to pause and think about it. And they got to chase each other. That's why he's lived all this, all this time. Let's get rid of these bumps. I can see if we can get rid of all these bumps. Eh, don't do that yet. Oops. Got to finish taking out the tree. <laughs> there we go. Take that out. Take that out. That one. And let's give you another another portal session there. All right. Take you and you. And we'll call that done. You guys can clean up all that mess. Clip those off too. Sand we can use, I think, for making glass. So we'll, we'll be out here collecting all the sand we can find too. All right. Um, and guys... Take him out one more time. Someone actually get it done. So three minutes left. I think that is enough time there. Uh, the back end. Does this get finished? Yes, it did. And you're still wondering what to do with the rest of your time. Let's get over to this side. What's going on over here? Lots of chickens. All right. Let's do that. We'll do that. We'll grab another row of this. And... Something like that. And now we're getting into nighttime, and pretty soon all of these graves are going to pop. So I think we'll skip. Although I really want that. Let's let's do that. Take him. We'll take these guys. And that a fiddle at us. All right. Let them take care of all that. Wow, they're quick. That is right over here. Okay. Ah, I see. It's uh, the tree mite. Let's give you another one, just in case this time's out from moving in and out of it so much. Like maybe we'll be here this time and actually see these guys all ascend. He doesn't have enough wool to go after yet. So farming has to do with crops, but it also has to do with animals. So we'll be able to corral in some sheep 
and even have our own flock of chickens. Come on, guys. I never want to do it when I'm here watching. Hmm. Let's pop that and that. Let's get this cleaned up while I'm here. Uh, guys, why are you over there? Can you not go over here? You really? <laughs> We're just gonna, you know, make this our playground, huh? That's really odd. This is the fastest way home. What are you doing? You're going over here to get more supply. Oh, we've run out of our timer here. And now we are in trouble. Okay. Can we survive this? Yeah, it's getting iffy. Come on. I think we've got it. When we get down to one heart, it lets us know. We have a dwarf drowning somewhere. Oh, they're having trouble on this much water. Dwarfs don't swim that well. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll tell you what. Let's clear that off. Take this out. I think we're done with the skeletons for a while, so let's go ahead and put in some more there. I'm under attack somewhere else now. He says, I am out of here. Good. Let's send you home. How do we do that? Hold on. I don't want you to drown. Okay. Give you a portal. There you go. Whew. I don't want to lose any dwarfs. So with that, you guys are just working away, huh? Yeah, you can't drown if you're dead. I'm going to take him out. Look, he's just making a mess of the place. Okay. That's interesting. Now, we use these leaves for a lot of things. So if you intentionally leave a couple of spots open, um, you know, clear out the, the front row of some of these that would uh, give you a place to uh, always harvest those and uh, farm them. Anyway, under attack. Okay, what else is going on? Portals that are out here. Anybody that's stranded? Nobody's in trouble over here. Done there. Let's click over to this side. If you look at the mini-map, you can see we've got two dwarfs over here. And this sheep is drowning. And we're not going to get access to the wool. Darn. Yep, tell you what, take this out. How quickly can we do this? Ah, oh, he just... Uh, but he's in the water, so we, he won't uh, trigger an attack. Hmm. But he will eventually. He just wooled out. There we go. Well, that's interesting. Ah, uh, it's, it's working slowly but surely. Okay. There we go. Grab the wool off him. Clean all this up, take it home. One more tree. I'd say we're done with this area. Okay. Did I ever load up the, uh, I bet you I didn't. The rest of the gear onto Yanni? I did not. <laughs> well, in that case, you've earned a, uh, uh, a better tool there. Give you one of those, and give you your armor and your hat. All right, let's run through the group here. Anybody missing something? That looks pretty good. Okay, that's the group. All right, 26 minutes till the attack. What do we need to be doing? I'm sure there are a lot of things we need to be doing. Um, how do we deal with this? Whoa, yeah, click and throw, and off you go. What do we do with this? It'd be nice to build a level with this, but it doesn't quite line up right. Um, I could put a row like that, too high and too high, kind of, but then three, four high? Hmm. Looks like it kind of goes at this level here. But that takes out this really neat row of of uh, torches. Come on now. Well, don't know what to do there, so we won't do anything just yet. But let's... Hmm. All right, we'll leave two. We'll leave these guys here. Maybe that's the route to go. Can't do anything with the door. So in that case, if we were to... Do this three high right there. I guess something like that for now. I just need them to be able to walk on it. We we'll get more creative later. Replace stone. 
That's different. I see. Okay. Replace stone. Now I don't think it's what I think it is. Ah, there we go. I think that's going to take out this stone front. That'll take out the uh, the spider web. Take out these spider webs. We'll use them for something. It's either for a potion or I don't know. Don't remember. All right, now we can go in with this. Build earth. Build earth. And with that, we will take this out. Remove. Remove. And just in case they get stuck in there, we'll take that out. We'll put another one right there so they can climb back up if they need to. Otherwise, until I figure out what this door is for, we're just going to build around it and jump over it, I guess. Alright, so take that out. That was different. So that's the layer behind. Interesting. Let's put that back in. And then we'll put this in. Uh, build earth. Alright, so we want to then... I just clear this out. And then that and that. And we're going to get into things that are under the under the ground, under the earth. So all kinds of things hiding down in here. A bunch of surprises. And we also need to secure this a little bit more. Now, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We kind of are. I would say clean this up right here and we're good. I think so. So in that case, let's ladder up. Yeah. Ladder up there. Take... Hmm, no, that's the hard way. Let's do this. First of all, we will replace the stone. Put a ladder there and there. We'll take out that and that. With that, we can get to that one, and we can get to that one. And that finishes this. So let's replace stone here, replace stone here. Okay, um, eight dwarves, one, two, three, four, five, six beds. We've got to do something about that. And really what we need to do is get into the uh, into the house. Can we get there before the attack? And will this attack have gargoyles? We're going to grab some more lumber. So let's... Um, portal into here. Take you out. And we've got plenty, so let's go ahead and double that one. I need lots and lots of wood. So you're going to go there, double you up, grab all those and some food. Under attack. Okay, that's fine. Get more wood coming, then we'll get to looking at our technology tree and see what we need to do to advance. And... Hmm... Kind of depleting our stone over here. Probably time to call that done. Let's... Where to? Right there and right there. Let's take these out, take those out. And eventually we'll clean the dirt out and make this more walkable. Take that and that, that, another one over here, and if it stays in place, we'll take all those. Okay, that one too, and a lot of water over here. Let's let the water run off. Let's take that out. Right there. He's not woolly enough. That is probably another tree mite. Yeah. But let's go ahead and grab some more leather while we can. Leather and meat. Um, speaking of leather and meat, did I ever load any more up in here? I did not. So let's grab the steaks. Right there. There's an extra in there. And top off the apples. Okay. You are what? You're this one. And we're starting to run out of daytime again. Alright, take out those. Those two. That's done. The water's all going to run off. No more of our animals drowned over here. Before we can get our... Although we could take these. Before we get our farm going. And have them safely indoors somewhere. Okay. Do that one. And let's give them an extra few minutes 
to get home there. There and there. And one more right there. That, this one, that pretty much clears out everything I wanted to clear out here. Okay, so let's concentrate on home now. What do we want to work on? Actually, basic construction's here. Oh, good. So our house is now available to work on. This guy, wooden wall. We want wood. 170, that's all we've got. Well, that's not going to go far. Darn, I was hoping we'd have two or 300 by now. Um, all right, well, we'll grab about, well, a bunch of those. And toss you out there. Do need to put the beds in. We'll toss that one. Toss that one. And let's grab these. House roof. Don't have many of these either, although it makes three at a time, so that helps. So I'm going to say 15 to start with. Alright, what else? House door. I need another lock. Oh, we do have two already. Okay, good. Lock and wood right there. And two of those. That works. So the door we'll put into there. Is that enough? I'm going to need a lot more torches. So I can't double click on this and make anything happen. No. So I got to go find it. That's in this one. There. So let's grab a bunch of those. Later we'll get oil lamps. And you know, this is all just the basic stuff. Soon we'll get, uh, oh, brick fence. I don't remember brick fences before. I remember wood fences for like a corral, but that's that's different. As well as a steel ladder. Oh, some new stuff. New to me, at least. Steel ladder. Ah, that came from the loot down below. Same with this one. Okay, stuff that we've not made, we just discovered. All right, so anything else here that is screaming at me? Yes, iron pickaxe. Iron Axe. Do we have any better weapons yet? Just the club. The backpack lets them carry more. Need more rope. All right. Let's spend a little time just working on this kind of stuff. It's not much more I need from wool right now. Other than the rope that it makes. There are a couple of recipes for wool. But I think we're okay to turn... Let's say all but one. We'll leave that one there. Okay. So there's 12. Uh, some crystals, they will be used much later, as well as the mushrooms, which we can collect from down below. The eye. Does it tell me what they're good for? I have an unlucky monster used for magic elixirs. It does tell you. Wool. Uh, fabric and rope. Ah, that's right. Um, I'm thinking some of the higher quality beds might use wool, but... We'll see how that how that goes, or uses the makes the fabric for them or something. Um, the two means two new things have popped in. To help with climbing, you can put climbing shoes on them. Uh, smithing apron. There'll be where's the thing for arching archery? It's not here yet. Uh, the handsaw helps for carpentry. Wooden shields. Hmm. We can make them. Hmm. Let's do it. There. We're really taxing our wood now. Give me eight shields. And let's go ahead and apply those right now. Before I forget. Shield. There. How does that work? Goes into that slot there. Ah, oh, the backpack's down here now. It used to be right there. I see. So we have an armor value of 6 until we add this. Now we're at 14. So attack value and uh, and how well we're armored. And everybody? Nope, missed one right there. So 15s and 17s mixed together. Good. Alright, so that's going to help with the next attack. Do we want to begin the process of adding skills? That's carpentry. What would help with carpentry? Carpentry is an inside job. So the one who's the carpenter may also then be the cook. And then also there's you know other jobs that are that are available in here. The one that, that mills the, the grain into flour. 
is also the cook, is also the carpenter. He just kind of roams back and forth. You gotta think of which jobs would be the best to uh, to combine. Um, let's continue clearing this out and get some torches in here. So we'll go to, oh, something like that and another one out over here somewhere. Eventually we're gonna find, this probably leads to something over here. Um, let's give these guys something to do. It's really quiet out there. Nighttime's happening. Or is it? I mean, the, I guess the music did play while I was talking, didn't it? It just feels too quiet. Oops, that was the wrong thing. You replace coal. I feel like the music is turned off in the game. I want some background noise. Alright, you guys take care of all that. We'll do the front one. Front. <laughs> Coal. Alright, well that's getting there. This is done. Enough. He's got nowhere to go. That reminds me. We couldn't deal with this because there was water there. It'd be nice to put water somewhere else and get it off of our wall. How would we do that? And while we're thinking about it, let's go say hi to these guys. Before they get up and over. Yeah, they're, they're too busy to... Uh, boy, it's hard to get a hold of that. There we go. Oh, there's one right here. Okay. Well, good. We got the hang around. No one's going to join you, huh? There you go. But we can't get into these guys because of the water. So, water will stay as long as there is stone surrounding it. It'll absorb into the dirt or sand. But as long as there's stone, it will remain. And then you get one full square high and fish will form. Anything else out here to do? No. So we have water over here. Hmm. We could replace this one with stone. Uh, replace front. Let's give them a pathway. I'm getting distracted here. I'm not building our house, am I? And let's replace this with stone. Uh, there. Replace front. Replace roots. That works and build well I can't I've got to have the water flow into here huh kind of want to dig down now but I they, they eventually you get scuba diving kind of like a all oh, the old metal can over the head thing and they can go down underneath and do things under the water but right now they won't do it let's take you out just to clean that up so I was going to go down here and, and lower this and make a much deeper well so this water can all run down into it. But what I... Well, there's already one long row here. That's probably comparable to the quantity of water that's there. Let's call that good. You're going there. We're going to take you because we need sand. Clip you guys off. Take this dirt out. Let all this water run. Some of it's going to soak in. Some of it will make it to here. And we'll eventually build this up higher. Once that's done, whatever's going to run in there, we'll put another piece of stone over here. And we get a nice deep lake over here to go fishing later. But I want the water off of our wall. It makes it so that we can't defend the wall because I can't trigger anything to be, uh, to be fought over here. out, take you out. There we go. Now the fish are probably just going to vanish. Oh, we're going to try to keep swimming. <laughs> now they're gone. <laughs> okay, let's put dirt in there. We'll probably grab one of the dirt they just took off. Thankfully it'll have to go all the way back to the, uh, to the inventory every time and build stone. Alright, so let's even... Take those away. Now this is going to run over here. I think that is the extent that it's going to go. I think we're done. 
Let's replace front there, and then we'll put one there. Don't really have to replace that one. It just feels like it'd be better if I had all stone down there, but I'm not going to be able to accomplish it. We'll do the one, though. All right. You're going there. And we'll call that little uh, terraforming project complete. We are out of portals. I'll leave a couple over here. Put a stone there. Uh, build stone. And take a chicken. And, oops, take all these out. You can't because there's a fish in there. Is that what's going on? Are we stuck? I think we're stuck. We will have to fish this out. And then we'll put the stone in. <laughs> okay. That was fun. Um, sure, let's give this a try as well. Not going to do the trees. Just take those two. All right. Oh, he just got the command to go and hunt a chicken. 13, 14 minutes until. Let's clear everything out up in here. Under attack, probably the uh, the wild boar. Take these out and what? Let's put in background dirt and then foreground dirt. And eventually this will be probably foreground uh, wood. Rat? We got rats again? Hmm. Now one thing I didn't point out last time is that when you take out the rat nest, it will leave a whole bunch of stuff behind. Kind of like the uh, the goblin colony that hit us. or We took out their encampment. It was supposed to leave a whole bunch of loot, and it didn't. So that's because I, I shut it down too soon, apparently. But eventually... You know, if we'd left it there for a while, there'd be all kinds of loot. Kind of like the chest that we broke out over here. and There was a bunch of stuff there. You guys can't get down there, can you? Well, the next row, I guess, drops down here. If we were to do that and drop the ladder in, then we can get down into here. Okay. But we finished pounding on this thing. That little gear is getting smaller. You'll be able to see all the loot that was dropped out of there. Roots and uh, hay or, or wheat. Okay, we already picked up a bunch there. Gonna pick up some more. Good. All right, we'll take care of this so we can. We already got it. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, we'll do that. Anyway, we're not going to get a full-blown castle built in here right now, but we can get enough to give the sense of how this works. I need this stuff cleared out. Actually, I need it to stay cleared out. So let's go ahead and replace front. We'll do that. All right. I'm going to take the hatch out, remove hatch. And we'll take it up another level. Eleven minutes. There we go. The hatch fell all the way down to there. Alright, so now we have more of a floor look to it. We've got dirt behind, though. Which... That might be a problem. We may take that out. We'll see how the next... Um, let's take you out. How the next layer of wall looks behind it. Which is where? Let's do something like that. I can't get through. Is that a problem? We're still having a problem here. Interesting. Um, everybody's at home. All the green dots are at home. Though somebody's on this side. What are you guys up to? Let's... Don't know what you're... You're up to over here. Alright, we'll clean it up a little bit faster. Oh, there's stuff over here, too. Okay. Wherever we leave loot behind, they will tend to... Let's take all you guys out. If I can. They're stacked on top of each other. Uh, they'll tend to, when they're bored, just go and collect loot. 
meaning right through a major attack. If there is a log over there and they don't have the order to go and attack something, they'll just start wandering out through them. So you gotta you gotta babysit them a little bit. All right, take them out one more time and grab them. Oh, the meat and wool, but oh, you wanted that bone first. Okay, we're done here. We're done here. Any other reason why you guys are going to wander back over here? Grab the last stone. We're done here. Okay. We're done there. We're under attack. Out at this end. Because I don't have a portal here and you guys are trying to get home. Okay. Take him out, guys. No more loot over here. No. Nothing's in the water. I'm going to pick up this over here and be done with this area. Got a, a green glowy zombie-ish thing there. Let's put one over here. Oh, we already had one. <laughs> These guys normally would be heading toward us right now, but they just found, they just noticed that uh, we're, we're over there, and so they're, they're heading to wherever they can go to, to eat dwarf for dinner. Oh, you think you're done? Get back up there. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to maintain the high ground. They get knocked off of there. And so they take a beating as they as they uh, fall down. Let's get... Oh, I put that up there on purpose to, for the rain. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Back to what we were supposed to be doing. Uh, only 45 of these left. I'm going to go through a lot of wood building this. And the grass does disappear, so I don't need to change out the dirt underneath. Good. I'm going to do that. I'm going to build a place the size of these walls. kind of like that idea. not sure how to get in and out, though, other than portal. We could try a door. Doors usually get attacked, though. So we'll have to see if we're going to do that or not. Let's replace roots and go there. Yeah. So let's get another layer up so I can put torches on it. And get these in so that nothing else grows there. Alright, that leaves us with 11. Now let's get back into... Oh, what you doing over here? Time to let go! Who is this? That is Floy. Floy was doing a pretty good job of holding his own, but he's right at the end got overwhelmed. All right, collect all these goods, including probably a few more uh, weapons. That all done there? That's all done there. And we'll mark you since we have plenty of portal left. Otherwise, equip. Well, let's wait to see if they got there. Yeah, I think it's all done. Let's equip. We did get one Skeleton's Rusty Mace out of that. So, we'll toss this one over here on Helene. Otherwise, everything is normal. Yep, I'd say so. Uh, level 8, as, as we go further along, it's going to take uh, more and more time to accomplish a level. So, you get up to 15, 20, it'll take uh, several episodes to get through a level. What are you doing down there? <laughs> yeah, okay. What I was going to do, six minutes left, I was going to actually look at windows. Can I actually get to them, or is that not a thing? I think it's not a thing. I think he's going to taunt them. Yep, he's going to taunt them. He's going to drive them insane. Let's remove wooden wall. <laughs> da -da -da. Da -da -da. Um, that's something to think about. Six minutes in, who needs to go to sleep and get their health back? Go rest. I think I'll let him get his job done before. Maybe you guys do that too. Before I accidentally send him to go rest after he's finally gotten there. And you guys can't figure it out. Never mind. You're going to drive me nuts. <laughs> okay. Sleep. Go to rest. And go to sleep. 
doing nothing. Sleeping. All right, so we can force them to go to sleep to get our health back up. Then we can force them to go eat. Oops, no, no, you go rest. That's more important. When they get to zero pieces of bread here, when they get to zero on their hunger, whatever they're doing, they will stop and come over and eat. Even if they're in the middle of a war, middle of a battle. So you kind of want to get them fed up before they get to that point. But if they're sleeping, that's even more important. So I'm trying to not bother the ones that are sleeping. Doing nothing? Yeah, go get something to eat. Same with you. Alright. They'll head down here and and uh, grab whatever... Are you... new or old? You're old. You're left over. Okay. So, we never did finish off this. Let's get you replaced. Replace front. And then... That's good. Yep. Then we will replace stone. And once I see someone with a stone walking this way... There we go. Then we will put in a dirt. Okay. Alright, so there's the back. What I wanted to do was see if... I can uh, make windows yet. So let's put the floor back in. Build a wooden f wall. Yeah. There we go. Let's take you out as well. Okay. Craft. Window. Window, window, window. We're not there yet. Let's figure out why. So we just finished off this group over here. We haven't made a wooden chest yet, which... Well, when I played last, they were only a decoration. You couldn't actually store anything in them. Don't know if that's still the case or not. I'm not seeing a window, and I kind of thought it was right in this area. Really? i got to wait that long to put in a window? We're getting into basic decorating here. But... Furniture. There's our fabrics and dyes and brickwork. And there's our first window? Wow, that's, that feels odd. Okay, well, we're not going to work with windows for now. So let's get some torches in here and get this place lit up. Um, what levels? Let's follow what was happening down below, I think. Well, we'll follow it for now. Um, where am I? Here? And something like that. But... We need to craft a whole bunch more of these. Let's get into something like that. And let's get a basic floor put in. So here's where it gets a little more difficult. I'm going to put these in. They're not going to be able to reach anything. They're going to get quite uh, frustrated. Until I can get in here and give them a way up. So let's... Um... I'd say here. No, I want where that ladder is. We'll go there. And we'll see if we can work with that. Out of ladders. Craft. And wood goes fast. Now, something I've not shown you. You can grab this and pull it down and do 10 at a time. Or 50 at a time. But uh, that's not something I tend to use that often. I certainly could have with these walls. So I didn't think about it. Um, ladders. Right there. Alright, we're going to get those built. And then, I'm going to do one more layer. Got to figure out where the pathway is actually going to go up. Do I go up the middle, or do I do two thirds and one third? I kind of like that idea. In fact, let's just uh, advance this all the way up. Yeah, I kind of like that. I want... You know, that's a lot smaller than it used to be. This used to be too high. This was quite mammoth. They've changed that. Just realized that. I always made the bottom floor three spaces high because it looked funny with this thing with its head in the ceiling. Interesting. We're still going to make it three high just because that, that ground floor needs to be a little more regal. So... Put you guys in here on top of. We 
We're getting there. Where are we? One minute left. And these usually started at night. I'm noticing now that they're starting in the afternoon, so you can still see what's going on. It's kind of interesting. You're going to go there. You're going there. So as far as doors go, normally I'll put doors at the top and then some kind of an outcropping and from there we'll put ballista which will shoot. And there's even Tesla uh, coils that spark and, and uh, kind of all kinds of fun things we'll get into. It would make sense if they had the ability to walk out, but the portal spell is what I usually use to get them to walk in and out. Speaking of, we're almost out of mana. That's That could be a problem. Let's do something. We have 19 gold. Let's get into... What? Let's buy... Five of those, and... Three of those. And let's quickly get a portal spell over here, and get this stuff hauled in. Hopefully before the enemy portal shows up, like, right there. Come on, guys. Pull them in. We might need these during this battle. I just don't know. Can't get through. Ah, okay. Uh, there. Still can't get through though. Still probably have to put that right there. And then there, 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 and there. And really quickly, um, find it, craft, drop this guy back in. Let's put him right there. Just in case I need to seal this roof up. Alright. Pretty much made it. What happened over here? We got it all. All right, let's just turn you off. Right? Everybody's in? Everybody's in. All right, everybody's in. We're sealed. We're sealed. Okay. Whew! Let's put a torch real quick right there. That's a bit dark. All right, where, is you? where are you at? You? Yeah, you're right where I thought you would be. But now they're not in water. So now we could... Come over here and... Okay, visit. So we're gonna have to play with these guys as well. Gotta be aware of that. Let's say, whoa, whoa, hello, you're new. That's a catapult launcher. You're launching these guys into our. Whoa, interesting. <laughs> um, guys, let's go home. And we have, whoa, and they fire arrows. They didn't do that before either. Yeah, heck with this. We're going home. <laughs> wow. So you launched them. They smacked right there. We got up just high. And they do climb up and go through if they're not four wide. Yeah. Okay. Well, before you guys um, contribute to all of this, let's get at least these easy ones taken care of. So come on, guys. Join in the battle. Yo, hello. Hello. And equip. If we pause right there, that's where we get into these guys. So we can go through space bar, find everyone who's been severely injured. When they get down to their last heart, grab the elixir and I think click and, and click use. The mana, I don't know if it's been changed, but it's kind of odd. You've got to use it on a person and then it contributes it to the game. Use one of these, and that just went up. So I always thought that was kind of odd. I want to take this and put it there. It doesn't do any good. And I want to take this and put it on one of them, but it doesn't seem to do any good. So that part of the game, to me, feels not quite right. We got everyone here. Just the one left. One left, and we're picking up supplies. I'm glad we picked up the supplies. Um... Let's do that. I wish I could fill this in, though. Where's big guy? Whoa. Where is big guy? Oh, we have a bunch of archers. Um, equip. Alright, so I stop in the middle of battle once in a while. It's my, my way of hitting pause. So I can kind of see what's happening, because very quickly... You, uh, you can get overwhelmed in these battles and you start losing dwarves. And I haven't mentioned it here in the series yet, but this is a rather easy difficulty. 
on this one. That's uh, the campaign mode starts you off on easy, and then it, it progressively gets more difficult as you go through the worlds. But uh, if you do it on on your own through the custom mode, then you can set up a permadeath. So when you lose these guys, they're gone for good. You get to level 20, and you only got two dwarves left. Right now, if we lose a dwarf. After a timer, after a minute or two, another one will will uh, spawn in and take the place of the one that left. So eventually, we we'll back to eight dwarves for level eight. So that's where we are here. But anyway, going through there, everyone's got at least one and a half. We'll keep going. So it is probably time to. There's our one and a half over there. Let's I keep hitting the wrong one. Equip. I want to hit spacebar to do that. Doesn't do me any good. Let's go ahead and use on live a health elixir you can see how that works so it adds one full heart so if you're two and a half you don't want to use one you want to get down below the two mark so you get the full use of it but spacebar moves you through and there is one other that is just a little less than two we're gonna say that's good enough for now. let's see what we can do here i don't know where big guy went i wasn't watching when that happened didn't make it over that I'm aware of. And they won. Now when they really win, you know, this timer's done and, and we're finished. They'll do a little jig here. <laughs> They'll be so happy to all just celebrate. But I want to know what happened to Big Guy. Where did Catapult go? There's our little dance. And we hit level 9. Don't know what we did at that second to give us a new level. But yeah! What, you didn't contribute? <laughs> okay. Well, with that, and we've got a new one to equip here. I think we're going to call this episode done. I didn't bother to even look to see um, what time I started, because I figured I'd just go until this thing was over. And I'll tell you what, we'll go ahead and and uh, grab these guys just for fun. Just for fun. Are we good? I think we are. What's a boar now? They're easy. Yeah. Problem is I can just keep going and keep going and never turn this off. So I'm going to call this one finished. There's that space bar again. Trying to hit the pause. There's the pause. All right. Let's call this one done. This has been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye.